There it is. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, let's get this thing. Get in there. Yeah. Man, man, let's go. Go, go. Let's get this thing. Easy money. That's what I'm talking about. So, fight. Follow through. Come on, now. Come on, let's get one more. Let's get one more. Hey. The NBA is calling me, but I gotta keep working. Gotta keep proving myself. It all starts with me. This is my story, and I ain't gonna let nobody write it but me. My career, my legacy, begins right here, right now. Man, <clears throat> I've been looking all over for you, man. Should've known you'd be here. Yo, man, just putting in some work. <sighs> what up, man? This is what's up. Bam! Yo, is that what I think it is? The NBA Rookie Showcase, New York City, baby! <laughs> That's the shot we've been waiting for. Oh my god, man. We're just one step from the NBA. <laughs> hey, look, man. This is exactly the shot we needed, man. You bring it in the showcase, and you are guaranteed to go in the first round, man. Guaranteed. Yo, you know I'm gonna be ready, man. <laughs> That's why I've been out here for the past two hours putting in this work. Yo, man, this is what I've been fighting my whole life for. Hey, man, man you earned it. You deserve it, man. You about to light up the stage and play your way right to the big show. <laughs> Yo, man, you just trying to get that fat agent's fee, man. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at me, dawg. Look at me. You know it ain't got nothing to do with that. I'm saying this because I'm a fan, man. I believe in you. All right, man, I'm feeling you. Well, look, I got three weeks to get out there and do my thing, so why don't you roll out? Let me get back out here, do what I do best. Hey, unless you want to hang around Shaq's balls, do what you do best. Oh, that's a low blow. <laughs> Especially since I remember a certain city championship, huh? Will yours truly save the day when you went out with foul trouble? Yo, man, that was the sixth grade, man. I'm a hero. <laughs> <laughs> ah, all right, man, I'm gonna give you that one. All right, man, yo, I'll catch up with you later, all right? I got some calls to make, including planning our trip to NYC, all right? Hey, don't burn yourself out now. We need you fresh. Ain't happening, man. I was born for this, man. I'm ready. Hey, how you doing? Ready to get out there and show them what you made of? Yeah, ready as I'll ever be, coach. Look, I don't need to tell you this is a huge opportunity for you and everyone else playing this game. You make a good impression, you'll be a lock for the first round. Don't get ahead of yourself. Right now, just focus on playing your game and showing everyone what you can do. Oh, I will, coach. This is what I was born to do. Time to let the world know. All right, listen. Before we get out there, I want to talk to you one more time about Jackson Ellis. You'll be matched up against him for most of the game. It's inevitable the scouts will be trying to see who'll make the better pro. I can tell you firsthand, he's not a player you want to take lightly. You up for the challenge? Yeah, I know it's not going to be easy. I got some respect for Ellis in his game. Yo, I'm gonna do my best to shut him down, though. It's gonna be quite the battle. Sounds like your agent has you well prepared to deal with life in the spotlight. Either that, or you're one of the most well-adjusted kids I've ever dealt with over these years. You just be ready for Ellis, okay? Now, we got a game to play. See you out on the court. Hey, man, you ready for this? What's up, Jackson? Yeah, I'm ready. I didn't expect to see you till we got out on the court, though. 
Yeah, well, it looks like they're going to have us mash up for most of the game, so I just want to let you know I ain't going to be taking it easy on you. Not expecting you to, man. This is a big night for both of us. Hey, man, I've seen enough of your game to know that me and you are going to be competing for the same teams. So we just got to go out there, do what we do best, and see how it all plays out. You feel me? All right. All right. Take it the easy way out then. You might not want to do that on the court, though. Or I end up owning you out there. Hey, how's it going, Jack? I think they're ready for you out there. Oh, this is your agent. Good luck with that, bro. What? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't let him get in your head. Hey, focus on the game. We'll be seeing, seeing plenty more of him in the future. I'm cool. Yeah, you're right. Thanks, man. Remember, man, I'm going to always look out for you, all right? all right? Now, get focused on the right thing, huh? The NBA. The dream. Right now. You take it. And don't let nobody stand in your way. You're right, dog. Thanks, bro. Here we go, baby. All right, man, you got this, boy. Woo! Hey, you take it. This is your dream now. All right, I'm sure some of you guys were even wondering if I was going to be talking in this one, but seven minutes in, what is up, everybody? It is Dunbar Snack Bar with NBA 2K14 on the PS4. Man, this is awesome. I think it's really cool that they implemented more of like a story-based type of mode here at the beginning. I wanted you guys to be able to just see what's going on, just kind of get to know Octavio Chadwell a little bit more because you're going to be seeing him a lot right here on this channel. Now, of all the games that I got for the PlayStation 4, this was the one that I was most excited about. This is the one that came last. But uh, I, I love this. Popped it in. I think it's great. The graphics are awesome. Gameplay just as sweet. I really wish I would have played NBA 2K13 a little bit more. But this is my first attempt at playing NBA 2K on the PlayStation in general. So this is going to be absolutely awesome. So Octavio Chadwell, we're going to call him the closer from Mexico. I'm going to have a little bit of a different strategy with Octavio than I did with Shao Kahn Mathlete last year. Shao Kahn was just all about scoring. But with Octavio, of course, that is going to be absolutely huge. I mean, I want to help the team out by putting up some points. Speaking of which, three ball does not go in. But I've also got to play smart as a point guard. I've got to be looking to get a ton of assists. So I'm going to be focusing more on passing than last year. Try to draw the charge right there. It didn't end up working. But you know what? Just give it back to Octavio. Just blow right past Ellis. Noel to Oladipo. He drains the three. So that's going to help out the team grade. Because that counts as a pass to the assist. Porter, I wish he would have put that one up. Could have been an assist. Looked like he was pretty open. But he gets that inside for an easy bucket. So I was really surprised at the beginning that Ellis and I were kind of going at it just a little bit. Still pretty friendly, but I heard from some people that you can really, really, like, get into it with Ellis. Like, you guys are arguing. Ah, tip pass. And it goes off of Ellis, so it is going to be our ball. But, yeah, I was kind of glad I took the nice guy route. I don't want to start anything too crazy here and I'm not even the NBA just backing it up double coverage I still get the shot over everybody and I make the three-pointer for the first points in the career of Octavio Chadwell I still got to get my four, uh, first points in the NBA so going inside into well who gives it back Ellis with his back turned that's to turn around quickly that's gonna be a long two-pointer as Chadwell had his feet on the line but no, this is absolutely huge. I mean, in the rookie showcase, I'm going to be a lot more selfish than I'm going to be with whatever team that I end up playing because this does determine, ooh, inside with Chadwell. You probably won't be seeing that too often. But yeah, this determines where I end up getting drafted, what team, you know, things like that. So I'm, of course, going to be making myself look as good as I can. Ah, open, but I'm not able to make that one either. 25% from behind the line. That's not good. That's not what I need out of Octavia. But 
It is kind of what happens. Oladipo going inside. He draws the foul. I mean, of course, you're going to start off here pretty weak. So baskets aren't going to be made as easily as I would like. And I can't just blow past everybody like I did with Octavio. I'm still going to try to see what I can do to... Or sorry, with Shao Kahn Mathlin, I was able to blow past everybody. But not here. Ooh, quick pass back. Another long shot for Octavio. Since I can't go inside perimeter shooting, it's going to be the name of the game right now for me. Going to be looking for just some open shots. Yeah, I know the place tell me I got to go over there, but just want to stay at the top. Oladipo getting it back to Chadwell. Another open shot, another three ball. That's going to put me at 13 points. One of the goals that I had to have was to get 10 points in the first quarter. I don't think that I got that, to be completely honest. Man, that's not good. But Len getting inside Chadwell with the rebound. All right, everybody's in front of me. Oh, get it to Porter. To Oladipo. The top of the key, nobody's there. I even get to dribble it a little bit before I put that one up. My field goal percentage is 66. That's pretty good. That's what I want to see out of Chadwell. That just means I'm making smart baskets. You know, when you even take a look at, you know, the shots that I've missed, too. Ooh, again on the inside, and I draw the foul. I wish it was that easy to get past everybody, but I don't think it's going to be that easy here, especially when I get to the NBA. It's going to be really tough. All right, like I was saying, I mean, even with the shots that I missed, they've still been pretty good looks, too. So I like that I'm playing smart here with Octavio. Not trying to be too flashy or anything like that, but they get the and one. All right, oh, that was a bad pass. How was that a bad pass? I was trying to see if I could go ahead and help out with the screen. You know, Zeller gets it inside. Wow, that was a, that was a pretty good play right there. And it helps me out as I get the pass to the assist. Still without an assist myself, though. So I go inside to Porter. Come on, just put it up, man. And he misses that one. Ellis with the rebound. Now Chadwell's got it back. Ooh, being double teamed. Get it on over to Franklin. Put the shot up, man. Oh, in and out right there, too. Well, the tough thing about this is it seems like, and I haven't been showing all of it too for the sake of time. There are times I just pass it to my teammates where I'm like, that is a great chance to go ahead and put up a shot, but they just don't do it. And that's, uh, I don't know, that's kind of frustrating for me, but here we go with halftime. That was not a great turnover. I got put on the bench after that. I think that was kind of a wise call because I wasn't playing too well around that point. But we're up by seven points, 50 to 43. So I'm liking how this is going. Ooh. I'm only a two-star right now. Like, I can't believe that they're mentioning turnovers. I only had one turnover, and yet that's what I'm supposed to do, cut down the turnovers. I mean, one turnover, that's going to happen every now and then. But now I'm, like, on a cold streak and stuff. Whatever. Get it to Oladipo, who goes inside to Porter, gets the foul and the basket. So a great way for us to be able to start things off here. At least when Octavio Chadwell gets back in. Of course, there was some time I was still sitting on the bench. This is the rookie showcase, so I don't have as many minutes as if I was a franchise player. That's another thing it's going to take some time for me to get used to. There we go, Oladipo with a good open three. So there we go with the first assist. It's about time that I finally, it's about time that I get it here. Oh, this goes inside. Oh. But that counts as good defense for me. I don't even know what I really did. I think I would have gotten the foul if it wasn't for the other player of the elites. Oh, there we go. Getting a steal. Chadwell, nobody there. Easy layup for the fast break. That's going to put me in the B-plus range. So I was thinking, I'm like, you know, when I saw that halftime statistic where it was saying I got to work on my steals, that I've also got to stop turning the ball over and try and help out with assists. I'm like, steals? I can do that. Because assists, like I've been saying, really been annoying because I haven't been able to get any because my teammates can't convert. But there I go. Back-to-back -back steals. Noel gets it over to Oladipo. He's going to go back inside to Noel. And that helps me out. Steal to block, leading to score. That's back-to-back -back steals 
for Octavio Chadwell on back-to-back -back possessions. That's good. That's another thing I'm excited for. I mean, I want to play a lot better defense. Wide open, feet on the line. They still miss it, though. Ah, that was a tough one. I was hoping that I was going to make that one because a lot of my shots have been at the top of the key. I really haven't done too much from the corners. All right. Put that one up. Yes, another three ball. 83 to 61. Wow, we're really dominating. Five minutes left to go here in this game. Come on, put that one up. I hope I don't get slammed too much for having only one assist so far. I missed that one. But team's just not shooting when it's it'd be a good time to shoot. Oh well. Alright, so seeing if they're still going with the double team. They're not. They go with the pick and roll. Go inside to Zeller. See what I mean? Even Zeller can't make it from inside with a great pass like that from Octavia. Alright, getting around. Everybody, I thought I could go inside. But it, they just all swarm around you, so I got to stick to the perimeter. And this works well for Octavio. They're not going to allow anything inside. Well, then I'm just going to hang out here and just keep dropping those threes until they go ahead and change their defensive scheme, which I don't know if the computer's really going to be able to do that. 27 points. The thing in the fourth quarter for me here is I have to score more points than Ellis. So to outscore him, I got to be taking more shots. But, oh, this could be good. The fast break. Uh, I thought I could just go ahead and pop that one up. Well, it's good shot selection. Doesn't help the team out. I'm still at 27 points. That one, well, rebound it. I'm just heading straight for the hoop. Oh, Zeller, come on, man. Drive it. Or give it to me. That one had some range on it, too. Ellis had his hand in my face. So that is going to be the game. I end up with an even 30 as the Elites beat the Stars 95 to 83. So a great game. Honestly, for not having played this on the PlayStation, I'm, I'm pretty impressed with my performance here. So what's going to happen next? So we're going to have the post game uh, coming up right here in a little bit. And then... We're going to go ahead and have the draft in the next video. You guys are going to see what team I end up joining. Maybe you guys will be able to see a little bit from my first game here as well. So I only got one dynamic goal. I think that was actually getting the 10 points, but I think I could have done a little bit better. All right. So Ellis and I meet up at the end of the game. So here it is. And thanks for watching, you guys. Yo, man. Good game out there even though you got lucky. <laughs> Man, we both left it all on the court. It's all good. Hopefully the scouts noticed, you feel me? Well, it ain't always about this one game anyway. They know my body of work. It's pretty clear who's the better player. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. We're going to find out on draft day, baby. Oh, film. <laughs> Either way, I'm about to take that NBA by storm, kid. All right, fellas. Yo, oh, all right. I'm about to leave you with your little man. Go ahead. Do your thing. Man, him again? Looks like it's a situation ain't never gonna go away. Come on, man. That dude can do all the talking he wants, man. <laughs> I feel like I let my game do the talking out there tonight. Absolutely, baby. Woo. Hey, man, look. I've been getting info right from all the scouts that were here. All right. I can tell you that they are more than pleased with your performance, man. Matter of fact, I think you finally moved past Ellis on most of their boards. What? And the media's buzzing. That's gonna go a long way, baby. Yo, man, I'm just glad to get that game out of the way. You feel me? All that yeah. pressure building up to that <laughs> thing, man. I'm yeah. ready to move on to the next stage. Oh, yo, man, speaking of that, man, we got a lot to do to get ready for the draft, man. All right. So go get changed. All, All right. right. We'll talk later. Let's do it, baby. Hey, man, you did your thing, bro. Woo! <laughs>